have the liberty to come to the house of the Lord because you made it known that, that it bothers you. And you and I know that when if something bothers you, when God is in you or he's working in your life, you're going to speak up. But some people like to use certain things for an excuse, but she was kicking back. I know. Let's give the Lord a hand. Oh, praise. Yeah. God is so good. He's worthy to be first. And I thank and I give honor to our overseer, Bishop Robinson, for the ministers in the house. Amen. Praise God. Thanks to God. God is a good God. He's worthy to be praised. Amen. Uh, I was looking for a uh, particular young lady. She isn't here today. Amen. Praise God. Uh, uh, make a long story short, the Lord touched her heart to bless me. And so I told her, I said, well, I found something I said that I could minister in. And I said, I'll wait next Sunday, but she's not here unless she come in later. But God is good. Amen. Yeah, amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Worthy to be prayed. Yeah, amen. And I just thank him. I, I'm, I'm so grateful. Amen. I'm so grateful to be here. So grateful. Amen. And my heart sometimes be heavy amen. for the many people that are going through. I want to let you know, amen, praise God, that we're praying for you, amen, praise God, and the whole long. And the Holy Spirit put something in my spirit, amen, praise God, that after uh, the Facebook session is over to pray for a few people, amen. amen. God is a good God because, see, he's looking for us to take authority. Yeah. Yeah. He looks for us yeah. to be who he said that we are. Amen, praise God. You're not to be afraid, amen, glory to God, but trust God. Amen. amen. God is still in the miracle working business. Oh, yeah. Amen. Yeah. Glory amen. to God. He's just looking for somebody that will believe the report of the Lord. Amen. Yeah. Glory to God. Amen. God is a good God. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, He's worthy yes. to be praised. Amen. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. Glory to God. And I just thank him today. And I thank God, amen, praise God for Holy House, for all of you. Amen. All of you are important. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, look, I had to put my glasses on, Trey. I thank God, I amen, know. praise God, that Trey is in the house. He didn't have to be here, but he here. He chose to come to the house of the Lord. Welcome back home. Amen, amen. praise God. God is good. Amen. But I heard um, uh, Deacon as Luisa said there's something about you going to rejoin. I said, he's liking this traveling stuff. Uh, I said, yes, he said, nothing, he's nothing around here in Macomb. <laughs> My God, God is good. Amen, amen. praise amen. God. Hallelujah. Just pray, amen, praise God, and be led by the Spirit of God. Hallelujah. You, you trust in him. Amen. Praise God. He'll be with you. Amen. Praise amen. God. Hallelujah. We're going to go on to the word that I got. And amen. I pray that the word of God bless you today. You know, I want to say this before we go to the word. So many times we come into the house of the Lord, people think that we're supposed to come into a party every time. It's not about a party every time. Amen. It's not going to be a shout every time. Yeah. It's not going to be, in other words, a message that makes you feel all goosey and amen, praise God, and like you want to turn cockwheels. But we need to sometimes come and just relax, lay everything aside, yeah. and hear what the Spirit of the Lord is saying to us. Amen. And take heed to the word. And most of all, please believe it. Oh, yeah. Amen, praise God. God is good because he loves us unconditionally. Yeah. And we're, we're to love one another the same way. Amen, praise God. And you know, uh, this message today, uh, praise God, it's not a brand new one, but it's one for this hour. It's not just for Holy House, it's for the whole body of Christ. Because there's a lot of disruption going on in the body of Christ. A lot of dissensions. A lot of schisms. A lot of division. A lot of, amen, praise God, accusations. Uh, false accusing. Amen. Praise God. A lot of monitoring one another. Amen. Judging one another. There's a lot of this going on. But I'm going to tell you something. The reason why I believe the Lord uh, chose this message for today is that because he has, a, he has so many blessings for the people of God. Until you know, just say, for instance, like at Christmas time when dad and mama go out and buy the toys and everything for everybody and they're trying to hold them all and they're falling all down on, on the on the floor because they got an overabundance of them in their arms and just overflowing. He got blessings overflowing for this house. Oh, yeah. But you know where there is unity is, oh, yeah. there God command the blessings. Oh, yeah. I said where there is unity, yeah. there God command the blessings. Yeah. They God. Amen. So we, we're, we're, we're uh, going uh, to go into the word and the word today is come together right now yes. in unity. Yes. Come together right now in unity. Now, 
And all the way for us to come together in unity, we gotta come to a spirit of agreement. That's power in right. agreement. Right now. Yeah. So many times, this one wanna be right. I'm right. Uh -huh. With my vision higher. I got a deeper revelation. Well, this is what the Lord said to me. And then, amen, praise God. The pastor say one thing, then we'll say another, amen, praise God. So what, what there's even strife and all these spirits operating, amen, praise God. He said there's every evil work. And it's the work of the enemy, saints of God. The word of God said we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and power. Spiritual yeah. wickedness and high faith, rulers of darkness of this place that come to divide and cause you to bite and, 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 and kick against one another, cause you to not like this one and like that one, cause you to respect this one and disrespect oh, that one, cause you to honor them and say, I don't honor that one. Amen. Praise God. God is not the author yeah. of confusion, but right. a God of peace. Oh, yeah. And He wants to come together. He wants you to lay down this stuff. It's pain. Yep. Since too much panning is going on in the body of Christ. Amen. 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 Even on Facebook and everywhere. Amen. It, it does you know, you know, amen, praise God. A lot of opinions and things that, amen, praise God, that we have a thing going on, but we need to hush. Amen. We amen. need to amen. shut it down. Amen. The word of God, amen. Proverbs 18, 21 said, amen, pray, uh, 18, 20, said, life and death lies in the power of the tongue. Yes. And they right. that love it. Now listen to this. Uh, Everybody always wrong with scripture, but you need to listen. But they that love it uh -huh. shall eat the fruit yeah. thereof. Uh -huh. So if you gossip back by you, uh -huh. your, your, your reward for that is going to be uh, uh, judgment. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Amen, praise God. It's not good, nothing good in that. So if you Amen. love that, you're going to eat the fruit of what you do. Yeah. Amen, praise God. You speaking evil, you, you cause the evil to come right back around to you. Uh -huh. Amen, praise God. It's a boomerang effect. Amen, yeah. hallelujah. Yeah. So it, it's... it's, it's it's, it has a lot to do with you controlling your thoughts, controlling your tongue, controlling your emotions. Amen, glory to God. Because yeah. so many times it's easy to throw javelins at people or throw hints at people. Mm -hmm. Amen, praise God. And I'm going to tell you, if you're connected with anybody, y'all listen to me. If you're connected with anybody, always bang, bang. Always putting people down. Yeah. Always, amen, praise God, have put themselves to be a judge over people. Right. Amen, praise God. Always saying this right and this right. And then life is a mess. You need to break loose. Right. You, need to, yeah. you need to loose them and let them go. Yeah. Amen, yeah. praise God, because they're causing curses up on your life. Yeah. They're causing the enemy to come in and attack you. Yeah. Amen. Some things, even if it's good, you got to rehold it. Y'all hear what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got this right. Some things even good you got to withhold because yeah, everybody right. don't love you. That's See, true. Right. we heard a song I, from Ryan. Thank you, OJ. Smiling faces. You're right. Sometimes they pretend to be your friend. Yeah, uh -huh. Amen. You got to watch all that. Yeah. Amen. Sure, right. And God is doing something in our lives right now. Right now, Amen. Praise God. He's purging out a lot of people from our lives. And I heard a message young lady uh, uh, gave for someone sent to me. Let go, I mean, stop crying over Saul. Stop crying over Saul. Uh -uh. I'm going to say it one more time. Stop crying over Saul. Those I could have had, oh, it should have okay. been mine. It's mine. I can't let it go. I don't know why I'm getting no attention, but I, I'm good, but they didn't see the good in me, so they chose somebody else, a, what, a house, car, job, friend, wife, a, 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 a girlfriend, a boyfriend, or whatever it was. Let it go. Let it go. Because God is doing something oh, new in our lives in this season. If you just let go oh, yeah. and let God, oh, yeah. amen, he'll show you a more excellent way. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. When I, the word tells us, he, uh, Jeremiah 31 and 3 said, I have loved you with an everlasting love. Everlasting. Listen to that word. Yeah. Everlasting. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Praise yeah. God. Yeah. His love is so powerful, it changed the world. Uh -huh. yeah. And that's the love that we're supposed to have maturing in us. Yes, Amen. Lord. So it's time Thank for us you. to stop being children yeah. and grow up. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yes, Lord. Now this is not a chastising word, but it's a teaching word today. Uh -huh. it's, I'm talking. I'm talking to the whole body of Christ. Yeah. All that will hear, believe, and receive. Look, when, when, when you when you used by God, you got to get out of yourself. It's yeah. not about you. Right. Yeah. In other words, say you know. Uh, everything, you know, it, it, it's about me. No, it's not. Get out of that self and you say, amen, glory to God. Amen. It's time for us to confess some things. Get this poison out. Yeah. You ought to be tired of bleeding. Amen. Hallelujah. 
It's time to be healed. It's healing time. Amen. Glory to God. God is good. He loves us. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Okay, let's go to Ephesians chapter 4. I tell you, if, if we just wait on God, yeah, and we just wait on God, amen, praise yeah. God. Don't go ahead. And, you know, so many times, you know, we love the message that makes us jump up and hear about hallelujah, wave your hand. But if the word is out on the inside, you're going to love the word. And if the Lord is speaking to you, you don't get mad at nobody else, point no fingers and anything like that. Just say, Lord, it's me, oh Lord, standing in need of prayer. Lord, God, help me. Yeah. Surrender to God, whatever it is. Because people, they, you know, they will hurt you. They will disappoint you. Yep. Amen, glory to God. Amen. But God is here to help. The word washes us. The word heals us. The word delivers us. Yes. Amen, glory to God. Ephesians chapter 4, beginning with verse 1. It said, I therefore, the prison of the Lord, beseech you that you are worthy of the vocation wherein where ye are called, with all lowliness and meekness with long suffering. For bearing one another love. And the key scripture, verse 3, endeavoring to keep the unity of the Spirit in the bond of peace. Now that's a capital S, that's the, I mean the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Allowing the Holy Spirit to work in you, to teach you, to show you. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. To uh, deliver you. Amen. Praise God. To show you, amen, the Christ like character that the Lord want to develop in you. Amen. amen. Praise God. Okay, and that word and that means to try to do. You got to try. Yep. You did not just gonna come on its own. Right. You got to try to do. Amen. To make an earnest attempt. That's right. You yeah. got to attempt to do it. You got to get out of flesh. Got to get out of self. Got to get out of Amen. Praise God. All about me, 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 me. <laughs> it's not about me, 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 me. <laughs> amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Strive to try to achieve. Yes. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory yes. to God. There's a lot of things that God is changing. Y'all recognize the change that coming forth in this house. Oh yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Don't go over there trying to look at somebody else's house to see what's going on over there, but you take care of your own house. Right. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. And he, and he talks about unity. It's the state of being one or united. Right. Amen. You may not agree what God has put in, 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 in one, one or the other heart. What to do, but does not make that you're right just because you don't feel just like, uh, well, I, he didn't show me that. Yeah. Well, I don't see that. Well, he don't show you everything, you and you don't, and you mm -hmm. sure can't see everything. Amen. 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 Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. He, he wants to come to that oneness. Amen. Praise God. Just agree. You can agree even to disagree and not fall out. Yeah, that's right. That's true. That's true. But it doesn't make no sense. People get mad at one another just because they said, well, Bishop told me to take the offer, and I know I used it right there, and I don't know why he called that person. That's ignorance. Oh, it's time to kick the devil out. Come on, God. Amen, Amen. praise God. Amen. But he said, yield, preferring one another. And okay. the, if he, he calls somebody, that's a deal if he called a baby to do it. You both say, well, praise the Lord. Amen, Amen. Amen. glory to God. Amen. What is it, how is it going to hurt you? <laughs> Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Now you see how sometimes the enemy can get in. And he can cause all these little petty dissensions between the same. And whenever all that stuff going on, God can't do nothing. I heard that. Holy Spirit be saying, these people don't want to they, they they too busy judging, pointing fingers, fighting, and, yeah. and, and bite, biting, and tearing one another down. Amen. Yeah. amen yeah. Glory to God. But when we enter into those doors, amen, praise God, we're supposed to come with expectation, yeah. with praise and thanksgiving, with gladness of heart, amen, praise God, rejoicing. And glorifying God, and then praise God that He blessed us to see this day. Saints, the world is in a terrible state. Yes, it is. A terrible state. Amen. But He told us what was going to be. He said going to be war and rumors of war. Going to be famines, earthquakes. Amen. Praise God, the cities and families. Amen. Glory to God. And so many times, this may be a word to somebody. A lot of our families are not saved, but some of them don't want to be saved. Amen. It's just simple as that. All of them are going to be saved. And let's say otherwise, believe the report of the Lord and repent and come to Jesus. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We can't keep them together. You keep your house together too. 
You, you can love them and you can go see about them, yeah. but don't be trying to uh, uh, push Jesus on them if they don't want him. Oh, yeah. He don't force himself on anybody. Right. This is a free will. Amen. Praise God. He gave them the choice either to receive him mm -hmm. or reject him. Oh, yeah. But he said they that reject him, they damned already. Oh, yeah. Amen. Praise Amen. God. Hallelujah. Oh, We've yeah. come too far to Thank lose all. Amen. 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 Glory to God. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Let's look at Philippians chapter 4. Philippians chapter 4. God is so good. Yes, Lord. He's worthy to be praised. Yes. See, we got we to gotta recognize the wiles of the devil. We got to see what he in there. Yeah. Amen, glory to God. Because I'm going to tell you one thing. This ministry here is built on the foundation of the word of Jesus Christ and the love of God. And the enemy is going to try to fight and come against you any way he can to try to uh, uh, disarm what you say that you have. And then praise God to try to separate you. Love, huh? It should be when the people walk in the door, they don't feel nothing but the presence of God. Oh, yeah. Amen. Yeah. Even Hallelujah. we've heard people say when they come yeah. up on the lot that they feel yes. the peace and the presence of yeah. God. Yes, and these people, most of the time, they had they, 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 their first time being here. Yeah. Amen. And then they said, you've heard them. They said, this out and still the love. Saints, so keep the real love. Keep the love alive. Yeah. Yeah. Don't let yeah. nothing come between you and God. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Praise yeah. God. He said, you're supposed to love him with your whole heart. Oh, yeah. Mind, soul, and yeah. spirit. Yeah. Your whole heart. Yeah. And he said, the second great commandment to love thy neighbor as thou love yeah. thyself. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Praise God. Yeah. And so many yeah. times, the reason why the enemy have his, his way in the body of Christ because that love, you don't have the love that you're supposed to have. Yeah, you have it to may be it. some hurts down in there. It may be some things that you went through. It may be, amen, praise God, some stuff that, a stronghold that you have not told God about and you released Jesus. him. But I, I guarantee you that if you just, just commune with God up on your bed at night from your heart yeah. and just search yourself. Search you got to search yourself every day. Oh, yeah. Amen, praise God. Because yeah. a lot of times we allow other things to enter in to change our attitude. Yeah. Amen, praise God. Sometimes it may be hardships. Yeah. Amen, glory be to God. It may be rejection. It may be, praise God, pain. Or someone, amen, praise God, may have hurt you. Amen. That you put your trust in. Amen, glory be to God. Give it to God. Oh, yeah. Give it to God. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Philippians chapter 4 and let us begin at verse 6. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6 said be careful of nothing but in everything by prayer and supplication and thanksgiving let your request be made known unto God and the peace of God which passes all understanding shall keep your heart, mind, minds through Jesus Christ. Now, when you have, amen, praise God, unity, you should have the peace of God. And if you have the peace of God, it shouldn't be no railing, no accusation, no fighting, no striving against one another. But you gotta learn how to yield yourself, amen, and honor your brother and your sister. Amen, praise God, prefer them, encourage them, Amen. Even though you may have wanted to do or be in that place, you just step by and say, well, that's right, they're a good person, they can do it. And not get mad and say it should have been you. Amen. It be over the small thing. The word of God says the little small foxes that destroy the vine. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you about it. If you keep on ignoring them strong foxes, if you don't kill them, uh -huh. they grow up to a big wolf fox. Yeah. Oh, Amen. Then it's hard to get rid of them. Oh, and I'm going to tell, tell you what a small fox is that grow up to a big fox. That's unbelievable. Unbelief is an assassination spirit. It will assassinate everything that you believe and that you trust in God for. Unbelief. It's a killer. And I'm going to tell you something. Like I told Bishop this morning, it's hard to get out. It's just like a, 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 a copter with his tool. Of, of, they call it old time with whittling. And he's trying to whittle a, 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 a horse out of a piece of wood. He got the children. He got the children. He got the shape, he got the children. Then he got the children and children. The things start making form and shape. That's the same way it is about unbelief. It's a spirit that it takes time to get out of you. Because when it when it's put roots, those roots go down deep. Yeah. And you hear the word of the Lord. 
And because of the report you heard, you were defined that God is saying what he said. Now, whose report will you believe? Uh, all right now. You going to listen to man or you going to listen to God? You going to put him before God? God can and God will. Oh, yeah. Ephesians, amen, praise God, for and Twitter said, amen, now to him that is able to do exceedingly abundant above all we could ever ask a thing yeah. according to Thank the power you. Thank you. Wow. that's within us. And that power is an awesome power. Yes. Yeah. And that's the Holy Spirit. He said it's not by might, not by power, but by my spirit, said the Lord. Yeah. It's the anointing of God that destroys the young. Yeah. And see, once that unity comes, unity is a form of anointing. Because when you come together in agreement, you can do anything together. Oh, yeah. 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 Amen, Amen, glory to God. Yes, you can. Amen, Amen. glory to God. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Okay, now I'm going to tell you about some barriers that you can have. Amen, praise God. Barriers, in other words, that will cause unity not to be in the body of Christ. It can be in your marriage. It can be in your family or your relationship. Amen, glory to God. Genesis 13, if you're writing it down, verse 7 through 8. And I just wrote the scriptures down, amen, praise God, this is thy time, so I won't lose you. Amen, praise God. And now we know the story in Genesis 13, verse 7 through 8, about the strife uh, against Abraham and Lot's herdsmen. But look at, look, but look at, look at, look at uh, Abraham. He stepped in there, he had the first choice. Or the best of the land. Amen. But guess what he did? He saw what was going on mm -hmm. and he humbled himself and he told Lot, you just pick out point where you want to be. Didn't you do that? Oh yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. See, these are the things that we got to exercise in our faith. Not only in the body of Christ, but in our our uh, dealing with people on jobs, amen, praise God, at home and with one another. Amen. amen. When you have a problem. And it seems like it's too hard to solve. Just humble yourself and go to that person and say, you know one thing. Even though it caused you to lose vision, or caused you to say, you know, I really want that. You prefer them just to keep the unity. It's a sacrifice. Yeah. And it's essential. We got to have it. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Okay. Uh, 1 Kings chapter 4, verse 1. Unity, can, unity cannot be obtained by force. Look at it, man, praise God, Solomon. Glory be to God. He, uh, he had 11 princesses under him. Amen. And he organized one. He, had, he set each one over territory. I, you know, I don't want to go to all the scriptures, but you can read them. You all, but I'm just breaking it down. He set each one over territory. He organized that so they wouldn't run together. So it wouldn't clash together. So it wouldn't be no dissension. So that's why we have to know our place in God. We got to sit in our lane and roll in the lane that we're in. Amen. Can I get a witness? And it won't be no friction. It won't be no argument. It won't be no fighting. It won't be no jostling on the road or trying to kick the other off and make them run off the road. If you do your job and if you stand your post, if you stand your right. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. I pray today as I prayed during when the Lord gave me this message. That it will take root and, and, and some manifestations. Yes. Amen. Praise God. Come forward. Yes. Amen. Amen. And Amen. some of y'all not going to want to hear this one here. Because you've heard it for years. But I told Lord, I said, Lord, help me that today, if, if you allow me to speak it, he just, and he brought it to my, to my, to my remember. Sure. Let it be said. Amen. All of us have duties. We have responsibilities. Amen. Right. Amen. And all of us, amen, praise God. Know that, amen, hallelujah, that you have liberty. But he said, I don't use your liberty as a cloak of maliciousness. Let me show you something. I think most of everybody here have had a job, so I'm still working, I know. Yeah. Don't you be on time for your job. Yeah. Listen to me now. Right. I'm not doing no job, but look, this is a teaching word. It's a change. The atmosphere is to change your attitude. It's to change your life if you were believing and receiving. Because see, I'm, see, God gonna know we gonna know it if it fall in good ground and take root because it's gonna be a change. Yeah. It's yeah. gonna be a change, and God gonna bless you for it. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. You respect the yeah. man that you work up on. You you be on time. Some of y'all be before time trying to press. Him. Yeah. 
Well, why can't you impress your father that blessed the man to have the job to give you that you can have the car? Amen. Don't you be on time for your doctor's appointment? No. Don't you be on time for to get your food stamp and your food? No, I know that. But I'm gonna show you something now. All right now. All right now. I'm finna. I'm finna. I'm finna throw. I'm, I'm finna throw it right back at you. That's the reason why some of us don't have the place, the position, or the blessing, or the provision that God has prepared for you because you don't think enough of it that it makes any sense, or either it does not matter. As we taught on Wednesday night, it does matter. Amen. 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 Praise God. Hallelujah. To respect yourself as well as where God is putting you. You don't ever know where your blessings are. Yes. You don't know if that petty job, you call it a petty job, that the man may not be looking at you because of your faith in that. I'm going to make that girl a supervisor. Amen. 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 The word of God said, do your work as you're doing unto him. And that's being faithful. He said, you be faithful over a few things, you make it rule over much. That's God, says the God. Amen, hallelujah. That's God. Amen. Glory to God. See, one thing about some of our friendships that we have, they're not no friendships. They're gossip ships. They're gossip ships. And that person that's gossiping about by they're bitter. Y'all hear him say, they're bitter, unhappy, and miserable. All right. And so they talk about other people, tear them down to make them feel big. Yeah. To magnify who they are. Yeah. I'm important. Don't nobody know what I know. I see, I see, I see. Yeah. They see more than the pastor see. Yeah. <laughs> but then if they see more than the pastor see, why are they lives in the bell? Amen. 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 I'm, I'm trying to wake up the Holy Spirit that's in you. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. To know that God is bigger and higher than that. Yeah. He got so much yeah. for us. Amen. Yeah. It's so much yeah. work to do. <laughs> it's room for everybody. Now we want to know one another. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You in my faith. You don't yeah. believe me over here. You go over yonder. Because yeah. I'm over here. Yeah. Amen. We right can work now. together. Yeah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. God gets the glory. Yes, Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Okay. Hallelujah. Here's another thing. How the importance of unity. And that's in Psalm 133. Very familiar passage of scripture. You can read that and go on. Verses 1 through 3. Amen, glory to God. That brotherly unity. We got to have brotherly unity. Amen, praise God. Hallelujah. He says, like the anointing oil. Hey. That flowed down the beard of Abel. Amen, glory to God. All the way down to the path of the skirt. Amen, praise God. The anointing when the word of God is coming forth from your leaders, amen, praise God. It flows not only on us, but it should flow on you. And it's the anointing that destroys the yoke and removes the burden. But if you resist it and you refuse it, it can't do nothing for you. Amen. Because, see, this is not a ritual. This is not a movie thing. This is not, amen, praise God, what we come to see. Amen, praise God, how everybody look or, or what they driving now, stuff like that. We come to be washed by the word of God. Yeah. We come to be renewed. We come, amen, praise God, to be blessed. We come to be healed. We come to fellowship. We come to commune with the Holy Spirit and hear what the Spirit of the Lord is saying to us. See, God will give you what you need. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And this is yeah. needed yeah. in the body of Christ. Yeah. He's about real unity, not yeah. forcing. You can't force unity. You got to work yeah. on it. Because oh, yeah. yeah. there's always going to be spirits to come in to try to hit it. And, I'm, and, and, yeah. and here come one right now. Yes. Amen, praise God. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Glory yes. to God. God is so good. Amen. Okay. So you know that uh, unity is very important to God. Our common faith should unify us. That's in Mark 9 and verse 40. Amen. Praise God. So I got on there. Amen. Praise God to go to the scripture. Amen. That's uh, Mark chapter 9. I'm almost finished. And I said, Lord, I said it's going to be a teaching message today. Amen. So many times, like I said, there's not going to be no party spirit all the time. We can jump and shout and turn. But something that's essential that's going to help you. Amen. Pray to God. There should be a change coming forward. Somebody yeah. should be changing their mind and examining themselves right now and say, Lord God, I know this is good and this is for me and I hear you, God. And Lord God, help me. Forgive me. I'm going to work on this. Amen. Okay. Uh, Mark chapter 9. Okay. 
verse 40. For he that is not against us is on our part. So we see that, amen, praise God, Jesus out with the disciples, amen, praise God. And just because the, the young man wasn't in company with them, amen, hallelujah, he's going to, uh, in other words, tell Jesus, you know, uh, but look at him, he over there doing, uh, casting out demons out of people in your name. And the Lord, he let him know, he said, now, if he's doing this and he's not cursing my name, he's doing something good. Right. Amen. Why everybody Amen. working Amen. in everybody else's business, wondering how they're doing stuff, and yeah. Amen, yeah. praise God, looking at them so hard that yeah. you can't even do your stuff. Yeah. Come, Amen. On, Amen. Oh, come, come on, now. Come on, now. That's right. It's so much work to be done, and yeah. our gifts, our gifts differ, saints of God. Yeah. Our gifts differ. God uses you in different ways. Right. He has yeah. other gifts, Amen, praise God, that are not even in the Word of God, that branches yeah. off from the one that you have. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. As long as you're doing good, you're doing all to the glory and the praise right. of God. Yeah. Amen. Praise God. It's account as righteousness. Oh, anything Lord. that's in his will, amen, praise God. Hallelujah. When it comes to righteousness, God accepts. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He may not have to say, go over and wreck your, your neighbor's yard, just like you think it would be in there like that. But he said, do good unto those, especially they of the household of faith. Yeah. Then yeah. also yeah. to the sinner man that you may win him, that you will show forth yeah. the love of Christ Jesus that's in you. Yeah. That yeah. you don't have respect to person. Yeah. God don't have respect to person. He yeah. just don't respect the sin that the people yeah. that don't know him, amen, glory God. But he loved them too. He rained on them just like he rained on us. He blessed them with cars. He blessed them with houses. Yeah. He blessed them with children, yeah. amen, praise yeah. God. He blessed them with abundance yeah. of money, amen, Hallelujah. praise God. Hallelujah. Yes, he does. That's what kind of God we serve. Oh, yeah. The only difference yeah. is that they do not receive Jesus Christ Lord and say, repent, amen, praise God. Turn to the way, turn to God, get saved, develop the right relationship with him, yeah. amen, praise God. They're going to miss out because they chose the pleasures yeah. of the world yeah. over God. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. He said, he that lived in prayer, they dead already. Yeah. Amen, yeah. hallelujah. God is a good God. Yeah. Okay, now, uh, John chapter 17, uh, the question is, why Jesus stressed and among believers, amen, praise God, that unity was important. Amen. Hallelujah. Let's look at John 17. And I have two more scriptures, and I'll be through with it. But just want to just, amen, praise God, enlighten you today, encourage you, amen, praise God. Let's look at the small father that's been eating up everything. Yeah. And we're going to kill that devil today. Amen. We're going to get rid of him. Yes. Amen. Amen. And I'm going to say this to you all too. Like I said, it's not picking on anybody, but just bringing things how, how the enemy get in. Everybody go through every now and then, but how are we going to know if you're sick and you're going through if you don't tell them about it? Yep. 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 Do I need to say it live? Well, I think they're how are we going to know if you're sick and you're going through unless you tell somebody? <laughs> Some of y'all tell people don't tell nobody because you don't want to call me. That's not the love of God. Come on, God. Amen. And then I'm going to show you something on the other hand. Let's come out of that pettiness. Whether they know about it, they don't call you or not. Grow up. I heard that. Amen. Look at that change. Pray to God. Yeah. Amen. 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 It just turned off that she ain't called me. No, they yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was in the I was in the hospital for a whole come, month. Come, come on now. Come and on. Nobody called me. Did what did you were you praying? Come on. Come were on. Were you now. showing love yourself to other people? Come on now. Come you on. read what you sow. Come on. Come on. Yeah. That's on every hand, says the God. Amen. Come on. And you ain't reading it different to our people. Amen. And you reject them, you show that come others. Now. Why would, why would they want to see you? Or why would you want to see them? Because they know you don't care. Yeah. Come on, yeah. It's time right. for the people of God to be real. It's yes, time for us to come together in unity. Yes, he man. said that he that have respect the person said it. Come on, girl. Yeah. Amen. But we look over the small father. Yeah. And God looking at you because he said, I know you got the truth for you and I know you can do better than that. Yes, That's man. not me. Oh. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, God is a good God. Yes, he is. 17. Yeah. Uh, begin with uh, verse 21 to 23 it said that they all may be one I start at 20 neither pray I thee for these alone but for them also which shall believe on me through their word Amen. that they all may be one that's unity as thou father art in me and I in thee 
that they also may be one in us, that the world may believe that thou hast sent me, and the glory which thou gavest me, I have given them, that they may be one even as we are one, in them and thou in me, and that they may be made perfect in one. Amen, glory be God. And that the world may know that thou hast sent me and has loved them as thou hast loved me. Amen. Yes. Glory to God. God is a good God. Yes, yes. He's Thank worthy you. to be praying. Yes. And so we know that, amen, praise God, that we are sanctified, amen, praise God, and set apart, amen, praise God, hallelujah, for sacred use of God. Amen, glory be to God. Cleansed and made holy, amen, praise God, through believing and obeying the word of God. And however, and whatever Jesus does, what he said, we're supposed to personify the same thing. Amen. People are supposed to see that light in us. Hallelujah. That Christ Jesus in us, amen. Not change it like Hurricane uh, Katrina uh, last week. And then this week, amen, praise God, you want to be um, uh, Cinderella somebody. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We shouldn't be those kind of people with such terminal spirits. Amen. amen, hallelujah. It's not of God. Hallelujah. Now, can't you see how the enemy will come in and deceive a lot of us? Think you got the right to be mad at people without a cause. And if you do, you say, go to your brother. Why don't we obey the word? And you ask, did you do that? No, I didn't do that. No, Pastor, he going to have to come to me. I ain't doing it. You're already rebelling. You're already being disobedient. So how the change going to come? You going to let the devil come in there and just tear it up? And, and when you come in, you with the wrong spirit. It affects a lot of people because they can pick it up. Yeah. And they'll look at you and you look all up on the wall and say, don't be looking at me. <laughs> we serve a holy God. Amen. Amen. And some of us want love, but we don't want to show love to nobody. You reap what you sow. Amen. He said, through love and kindness have I drawn thee. He yeah. said, love not a word only, but, but, the, but a deed and, a tr and truth and deed. Oh, yeah. Amen, hallelujah. Amen. Do something sometime. Bake some cookies. <laughs> Amen, get some flowers. Whatever that person likes. And that's the thing about it. We were talking about it, man, praise God, a coming together that you can know one another. Right. You got to know Amen. one another other than you, my brother and sister in Christ. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. The father's and the son and the son is in the father. They know one another. They work as one. Uh -huh. We yeah. got to know what one another like too. You got to step out and do things. Amen, glory to yeah. God. Amen. You got to love unconditionally. Amen. 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 Glory to God. We, you don't always have to do things alone. Get together and come into agreement with one of your fellow sisters or brothers and put all your pens or whatever you got to do together. Two or more than one. Oh, yeah. You can do more together yeah. than by yourself. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Glory, yeah. To yeah. glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Okay. Galatians chapter 5. Amen. I'm getting ready to wind it up. I'm like, well, this Bible class, isn't it? If both, uh, if, yeah. Believe it or not, every time you come to the house of the Lord, ain't nothing but Bible class. Yeah. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Galatians 5. Uh, We're going to begin with verse 13. It says, For brethren, ye have been called unto liberty. Only use not liberty for an occasion to the flesh, but by love serve one another. What did he just say? By love serve one another. Amen. Amen. For all the laws fulfilled in one word, even in this, thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself. But if ye bite and devour one another, take heed that ye be not consumed one of another. Amen, praise God. Hallelujah. Oh, my God. My, my, my God. Oh, Jesus. This I say then, walk in the spirit, that ye shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. See, that flesh will tell you to go off. I'm going to get her told. She don't know me. I ain't been saved all my life. Don't let the devil get no stronghold in you yeah. like that. That's why a lot of people are dead and a lot of them in prison right now. Acting on the flesh. And once, and once you activate that flesh, the devil come and he taking over. You see how you're doing people now. And when they people get caught, they look so wild and wind like they said, what happened? Not sure, no kind of emotion. Amen, praise God. They just do something and they 
tough on like they say? Well, I'm just another one bit the dust. No emotions, nothing. <laughs> Don't care. Because the devil will come in and deceive them. Yeah. Amen, praise God. Okay. He said, for the flesh lusts against the spirit, and the spirit against the flesh. And these are contrary one to another, so that ye cannot do the thing that you would. Amen. But if ye be led of the spirit, ye are not under the law. Amen. Glory to God. God is a good God. Hallelujah. So, when we're motivated, when we're not motivated, amen, praise God, by love, you can tell we become critical of one another. Yeah. Very critical. Yeah. Yeah. Unfeeling. We talk about, I don't care either. You know, yeah. every, you know uh, uh, I went through it, so what about her? Amen. Amen. Just uncaring, that's cold and cackles yeah. in your yeah. words. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And then in the word of God, you do, it makes you stop looking for the good in people. That's right. You stop looking for the good, and all you can see is just she nobody but Jason. Ooh, that's all I see is Jason. Ooh, 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 Amen. Ooh, praise ooh, God. Ooh, Hallelujah. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> and see, we do the only thing we can see faults, but we can't see our own. That's the sad right, thing, right there. Yeah. We can see other yeah. people's faults, yeah. it out, but we can't see our yeah. own Amen. shortcomings. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory right. to God. No. So, when you do that soon, the unity that you did have will be broken. That's how yeah. when the enemy come in. Amen. You come in here, won't, don't want to touch one another. You know, look, I'm going to sit over here. I don't want to sit beside her. I don't want to hug her. Hey. You know. Amen. And you were saying, I don't know what's going on over here. Well, it's good if you're concerned to ask them what's going to come. We do go through things. Right, yes. And sometimes, like I tell people, you don't be the same all the time. I don't care what you say. We can put our best foot forward, but see, that's the thing about your heart. You can you can already meditate and devise how you're going to do and how you're going to look and how you're going to be. Yep. You can be going through hell and high water. And somebody would do, oh, praise the Lord, sister. You just got through kicking holes in the wall. Yes, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Oh, yes, Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. <laughs> everything. Amen. Because God see. He see me, know. <laughs> Instead of saying, I just had a meltdown. <laughs> and I'm so glad you came down. Would you please pray for me? <laughs> See, God know that we're human. He know that we He's familiar with our, our, our human friends and our weakness. Yes, Amen, glory to God. He's not going to persecute you for you having a melt meltdown, but you got to soon come to yourself and know who you are. Yeah. And receive the help that's off you. Let me pray for you. Now, I don't want no prayer right now. Yeah. I'm just mad. Yeah. Amen, praise God. Uh, when well, you want to talk about, I don't want to talk about. <laughs> but time they need yeah. to call it everybody in your black book. Yeah. <laughs> so everybody in the car know what, what's going on with you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My God. So we need to stop talking behind one another's back. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Amen. If you want the blessing of the Lord to dwell yeah. in, in your house. Yeah. Amen, praise yeah. God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. So what you have to do, you got to focus, amen, praise God, on their strengths and see the good in them. Oh, yeah. It's bad if you can't see good in people. Yeah, right. It's real bad. I don't care. Even yeah. in drunk, you, drunk up, you can see good. Yeah. Even yeah. in a prostitute, you can see good. Yeah. They're human. Yeah. They're still human. Amen. Doesn't yeah. need help. Amen. amen, praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. And just remember, Jesus commanded us to love. He said, love one another because I first love you. Oh, yeah. We forget about that. Yeah. We want to fight, we want to get in the flesh, and we want to try to prove a point. Yeah. Amen. But God is looking. Okay? Yes. And the last scripture, amen, praise God, is in 1 John chapter 2. And I'm going to pray. And now... Uh, Sister Candace, um, when I finish the scripture, you just throw some soft music. I want to pray for a few people. Amen. Praise God. After this part is over. Amen. Okay. First John chapter two. Verse seven and eight. It said, Brethren, I write no new commandment on you, but an old commandment, which you had from the beginning. The old commandment is the word which ye have heard from the beginning. He don't change his word. Amen. It's not going to change. Amen. He said again, 
a new commandment I write on you. See, we have to be refreshing some things. Because people think, because he said about love one another, oh, that just, that's, he just said this is love one another. Amen, praise God. He's not talking about love it as the world love. They love with dissimulation. And you do one thing wrong, they're ready to cut you off. And it's and, and, and hard to forgive you. Amen. But God loves evil being treated. He, he, he's merciful, he's kind, he forgives us. He said, if you don't forgive men, they trespass you. He will not forgive you yours. Oh, yeah. right. So you always got to consider yourself. Yes. Amen, glory to God. He said, which thing is true in him and in you. You heard what he said, which is true. I'm mean, right on you, which, which, which thing is true in him and in you. Because the darkness is past and the true light now shines. Yeah. Is Jesus shining in your heart? Right. Is he shining in your heart? Does the word of God bring conviction when we, gotta, when we get out of character with God? Or out of character with one another? And when you're alone, they mean you think nobody hearing you and you talking about your brother, sister, tearing them down, but everything being recorded and helping your angels is recording everything you're saying. Yep. That's recording everything you're saying. <laughs> Amen, praise God. You're not, getting, you're not getting away. You may think you get by, but you're not getting away. Amen. So it's time, amen, praise God, for the change that God is working in us. Amen, praise God. And we submit to it. And that, amen, praise God, we do better. We work on those areas whereby people point fingers at you. And they say, no, I don't, I don't want to be like her because this cause that. Amen. We need to continue to wash our garments, amen, praise God, in every spot. Amen. And what's so good about God, he's so merciful, amen, praise God. He's given us time to do it. But don't take advantage of time because time is not on our side. Amen. And I pray today that the word come together right now in unity, that it bless you and, and, and that it shine a, shine a light in, to our hearts to, amen, praise God, where we got that old parched ground, that old hard ground. Don't want to be moved to stubborn. <laughs> it's just me. Stop saying it's just you. I heard that. When Christ came into your life, you became a new creature in him. He's working on you, washing with the word to make you new. The ways do to conform to his character. Right, Amen. Yeah. Praise God. God is good. Yeah. So I'm going to say just a brief prayer and then I'm going to pray for the people. Amen. Praise God that the Lord put in my spirit to pray for. Father God, we just thank you, Father God, for the word of God today. We thank you for the truth. Lord, you said, and we shall know the truth, and the truth shall make us free. And whom the Son of Man made free is free indeed. Lord God, you already know, Father, what we have need of before thank we know. And Lord, we just ask you, Father God, that you shower down your mercy, God. Hallelujah upon your people. Father God, we bring ourselves to the mercy seat. Hallelujah. And we lay prospect, Lord God, and ask you to search us, God. Search every inner part, Lord God. Break up that old fellow brown of hardness and pride and arrogance, Lord God, and hurt and pain, Lord God, and rejection, Lord God, that many may have received, Lord God, even though it wasn't do them, Lord God. We know that, Father God, that you can heal. That you can rebuild, you can remold, you can reshape, hallelujah, renew our lives, Lord God, through the power of the Word of God and the Holy Spirit. We give you praise. And Lord, we just thank you so much, God. You've been so good to us. You've been better to us than we've been to ourselves. For great is thy mercies, Lord. For thy mercies are renewed daily. Father God, bless the people of God. Help us, Lord God, to examine ourselves, Lord God, and to wash our own garments, Lord God. God, we try to wash somebody else's garment. We may not know how to wash it, Lord God. But we know, Lord God, what the spots that are in ours. Yes, yes. And Lord God, we commit these things to you today and ask you to have mercy upon us, Lord, and deliver us. Forgive us, Lord God, for the error of our ways. Forgive us, Lord God, for doing our own way. For your ways are so much higher than ours, so are your thoughts. Lord God, we just pray, Lord God, let the word wash and cleanse. Cleanse, Lord God, our minds from dirty and evil thoughts, Lord God. From pointing fingers, Lord God. From being so grouchy and so mean and so indifferent. But it come down to the truth, Lord God. Father God, create in us a clean heart, O oh God. And renew a right spirit in us, Lord God. Renew the spirit of our mind. For you said, let this mind be in you. That was also in Christ Jesus. Lord, help us. And Father, today in my closing, this part of the service. Lord, there may be someone, Lord God, that looking by way of Facebook, Lord God. That said, well... I'm guilty of a lot of these things. 
Father God, we know you said, now there's no condemnation to those that are in Christ Jesus. Okay. Father God, we're just to come to confess. Be God and sorry, repent, and turn from it. Lord God, that may not have the strength to turn. But Lord God, grant your people, Lord God, the power to forsake. You said, lay aside every sin and every weight. Yeah. That's so easy to set us, that we can run this, pace, this race with patience. And Lord God, there are things that have been called us to be stagnant because we just refuse to step up to the plate and admit and confess and release and let go and let God. Yes. Father God, we want to go higher in the old God. We praise your name. We ask that you reign on our field, Lord God. Reign on our field, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. And cause, Lord God, the seeds of righteousness to spring forth. And cause those seeds of righteousness to remain in us, God. That we can shine forth and show forth the glory and the praise of God. Can't nobody do this and do us like that but you, Lord. And we thank you today. We praise you, Father God, for the presence of your glory. We just thank you, sweet Holy Spirit, hallelujah, for empowering us, for impregnating us with your word. That, Lord God, we may bring, Lord God, how this pregnancy is full term. And that as it birth forth, Lord God, let's cause, Lord God, the fruit, Lord God, how low goes sometimes, the spring forth, Lord be God. That it be beautiful, Lord God, that it be fragrant, Lord God. That it be, Father God, pleasing in thy sight. And a sweet order in your, in your nostrils, Lord. We give you praise. And that man may see the light of Jesus Christ in us and run to that light, Lord. Lord, help those that are weak and that are going through. And that feel like, I, I don't matter, Lord God. Everybody matters to you, Lord God. We come boldly to the brooks that we may drink freely of the river of living waters, Lord God, that you shall, shall flow from our bellies. We give you praise. We thank you, Father God. We give you all the glory. We give you all the praise. In Jesus' name, we thank you. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 You said that I'll can that you can move your table because you should call some of the ones that own the house and need prayer.